Hey guys, I'm going to real quickly show you this really cute hairstyle with a pop of color in it. That's right, there's no color in this hairstyle. It's very cute and simple actually, it's not that hard. I just tried it out and it took like 5 minutes. So, um, <clears throat> if you don't know how to French braid, this might be a little hard for you. So if you don't know how to French braid, um, you can watch videos on how to French braid. I have a couple videos where I'm French braiding, but all you have to really do is keep adding hair to a braid. It's quite simple once you learn, like, I know it was really hard at first, but once you learn, it's really easy. And, um, yeah, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to need, like, a long little ribbon, and I have just this red ribbon. And since it's springtime, reds, pinks, yellows, bright greens, stuff like that that are, like, colors um, are very cute. So if you have any ribbons that are, like, colored, like, so just take it out and use it. Um, <clears throat> if you don't have any bangs, or if you do have bangs, we're going to start off from one side of your hair and just remove a part of your bangs or that side of the hair to one side and kind of just take your ribbon. We're going to want to tie it around this little piece of hair. So, make sure it's tight. And then we're going to take the hair and kind of cover it up a little. So there we go. Okay. Now we're going to start braiding. Bring all your hair to one side like so. And just take the hair, the first section of your bangs. Create um, three, three different sections to start braiding like so. And one section is going to have a little bit of hair with the ribbon. And now we just start braiding. And see this little piece of hair? We're just going to add a chunk to it, keeping the other two separated like so. And then braid, and then again, just add hair. So this is how simple that is. You can add hair from different parts like this if you want to the hair. And it's very simple. French braiding is actually quite easy. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward and again, just keep adding hair and keep going down. Okay, so now that you've gotten to the end, we're going to take the little last bit of the ribbon and kind of just wrap it around and around, securing it. And you guys can see that a little bit of my bangs came out. It looks kind of cute, so I'm just going to leave it. Okay, I'm going to kind of create like this little hole and just take the rest of the ribbon, stuff it in there. Tightened like this. So you have it like so. I think you guys can see that. And then you can just leave this out if you want or you can just braid it back. That's what I'm going to do. And take a bobby pin and just take that out of your way. Alright, so this is a finished look and hope you guys liked it. So it's just like this little French braid on the side with a little ribbon through it. Um, if you can, you can make the ribbon more visible throughout the hair. I didn't get, get to that. The ribbon kind of just disappears. It goes like all random. But if you want, you can just make it more visible throughout the hair. But yeah, this was it. This was a cute little spring hairstyle. It's totally chic and adorable and people will be like, how'd you do that? It's so cute and stuff. So yeah, I recommend trying to make the like the little yarn, the little ribbon more visible throughout so, the yeah, hair. So yeah, this is it, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Try it out, and um, let me know if you like it, and thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.